I was a child of, of the 50s. Uh, I, was, uh, I was captivated by space uh, because of the launch of Sputnik. Sputnik was something that uh, probably lit the, the fire, or lit the spark of space for many children. I was not the only one. There were many others. And many of those children uh, became fellow astronauts. And I met them all uh, when I came to work at NASA. And then I met them, the ones that were also in Russia, and the ones in Europe, in Japan, and all over the world. There are lots of children, young people, who want to realize these kinds of dreams. We need to give them the field to do that. I had many heroes, still do. The number one hero is my dad. My dad was um, the one person that I wanted to be like. He was not a scientist, he was not a, an engineer, but he was uh, an adventurer. He was a, a guy that um, didn't, was not af afraid of anything. And I wanted to be like him. And um, <clears throat> even today when I am faced with a difficult problem, I had to make a decision, I always uh, ask myself, what would my father do in this same situation? And it helps me a lot to uh, arrive at a, at, a, at, a, at a decision. Inspiration um, is in many ways uh, a bit of a chain. Uh, I was inspired by others, and maybe I was or I am uh, an inspiration to some. And that is part of the way it should be. Uh, I, I feel that this was not part of my plan to be an inspiration, but it is a responsibility that I have acquired and I have to be true to it. I hope uh, those who come after me will inspire others as well and so the chain will be unbroken.